<laughs> that was funny. Uh, I hate Rufus! Uh, die. We should definitely do that again sometime. Hey, man. I think the guy over there is trying to get your attention. Huh? Where? Oh, him. Now, uh, that's just my chronicle. Hey, 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 I want the time loop! And why is he getting in such a flap? No idea. All I can hear is... <laughs> Good thing I'm an expert at reading lips. Come on, give me a come on, give me a time reset. Come on, give me a time. I think he's saying time for bed. That was that was this was time reset. You go, you go, it was starting. And some choir is farting. To me, it sounded more like time reset starting. Yeah, but that wouldn't make any sense unless, of course, uh oh. For crying out loud, I missed her again. Hey, who's there? Uh, room service. Uh, the service bots have, uh... Well, that's... Take my helmet to the cleaners and be gone with you. Okie dokie. <laughs> ah, why is that? That doesn't make any s I should talk to Mc... Say, ah, uh, that was F. Recognized connecting to system. Welcome, Prime Controller. New in to act your Elizabeth. <laughs> Goal? Yes, who? Oh no. Dad, please don't go all Prime Controller on me. I told you I'm going camping. Like hell you are. I know that you plan on accompanying Cletus to Deponia, but that's not gonna happen. You will stay here. Do you understand me? Uh, why should I? Because I forbid it. Really? Well, newsflash. I'm not one of your Organon soldiers. I am going to Deponia, end of. Or is there some other real reason why I should remain here? Because nothing matters without you. Dad, have you been drinking again? What? Uh, no, I, uh... I am not carrying on this conversation while you are drunk. I am going to Deponia, end of. Or is there some other real... Because you are under house arrest. 
house arrest. Dad, I'm not 14 anymore. Also, this engagement to Cletus was your idea. What's wrong with spending a bit of time with my future husband? Under no circumstances. The engagement is annulled. Uh, this is not one of your stupid demolition maneuvers. This is to do with my future. And if I want to start my future in a pile of trash, there is precious little that you can do about it. I am going to Deponia, end of. Or is there some other real reason why I should remain here? Because otherwise, I'll activate the self-destruct sequence. You... what? Okay, I am not able to take you seriously anymore. Do what you like. I'm not talking to you. Hey, what are you doing? I'm initiating the self-destruction sequence, as promised. You wouldn't dare. Just watch me. I knew you were bluffing. So long, Dad. Damn, that looked really promising. I'm sure I can convince her with the right emergency codes. All I need for that, and... to the locks. Mm-hmm. A very popular choice today. Then off you go! Oh, no. The cable boat has already left. Oh, what do I do now? Do you want to hear my suggestion? McChronicle, what are you still doing in the air shafts? Not interfering. Yeah, incredibly productive, especially now that time has been reset. I know. Someone must have used the crank on the chrono car. And now they have to celebrate Barbecue Thursday all over again. That'll teach them. I fear not. If they didn't have tinfoil hats on, they'll do exactly the same thing tonight. And then again and again. And we're stuck here and can't do anything about it. It's the end of time as we know it. You mean today will just repeat itself forever? Huh. I can imagine worse. Like what? Well, today wasn't a bad day. I had fun. Just too bad the goal isn't here. Maybe I can persuade her in the next loop. Then we'd be happy here on Elysium till the end of time. But that's just not possible. Time would never move forwards. Yeah, I got that part. You can stop with the advertising already. But, oh, oh, what have I done? Does he really want to stay stuck in this shaft for all eternity? Say, Mac. Yes. Can you please stop goal next time? Without her, this place would get pretty bleak after a while. Impossible. When she passed by here, I was still stuck in the duct. I also think your plan is pretty self-centered. Oh, you find me self-centered? How many times have you saved the world? or plunged to your death for others, huh? Remember, you have not done any of those things as of yet. Well, I see that a little differently. I think I've earned an, and if they haven't died, for a change. Don't you want to come out of there? No, this is not our time. We shouldn't touch anything. <laughs> what nonsense. Those who never touch anything leave no traces. And that goes for time exactly the same way it does for Wenzel's pudding. What do you think we should do? I'm at my wit's end. The high boat has left, and with it, our only chance of getting to Deponia on time. <laughs> I wasn't planning on it anyway. Uh, but, but Rufus, you have to. Or do you really think that you can get by without a planet under your feet in this timeline? <laughs> I can save Deponia from here. I just need to go to the Council of Elders and... <gasps> in 
inspiration. If I prove to the Council of Elders that the Ponia is inhabited, then the inspection is unnecessary. They'll call the high boat back. Jumping jellyfish. Then we would still get to Deponia in time in order to prevent the time reset. Or I could just stay with Goal on Elysium. Final fanfare, curtain, happy end, standing ovations. And the next day, exactly the same curtain will rise again, and then again, and again. Ah, uh, that's show business. Just to make sure that I... What time did we land here this time? In the meantime, I'm pretty certain that today is Thursday morning. Barbecue Thursday? Exactly. Our trip has taken a total of approximately minus 12 hours. I will arrive in Kuvak tonight. The sun is just rising in the southern quadrant, so I'm already sound asleep in the balloon. And I'll get into the chrono car in Puerto Rustica. Unimaginable, I know. Yeah, for someone as unimaginative as you, maybe. Does that mean that we now exist twice? Yes, until we steal the time pod tonight. Oh, steal is such an ugly word. How about borrow it for a test drive? Oh, so you intend to return it? Yeah, I, exactly. And then it was stolen from us. We're the victims here. Fascinating how you change the story according to requirements. <laughs> hey, history is written by winners. What's causing these time resets? I'd like to know that too. Someone is obviously using the crank on the chrono car. Unfortunately, we have no way of preventing it while we're up here. This is the end of time as we know it. Well, you make it sound so negative. Why do you think that our past tense selves will behave the same way again? Very simple, because we're not reset down there, but here. Huh? This evening, in the past time loop, there was only one Macronicle in existence, the one on Elysium. After all, the other one stole the time pod. And as that one's memories are now in my head, it is safe to assume that the one down there comes away empty-handed. So much for simple, huh? I don't think this day will be repeated forever, because if that were true, how could we have been able to travel into the future earlier? Huh? Galloping Gandalf! You're right! Yeah, well, I guess that means you can turn the red alarm back off, huh? Above all, it also means that there is a lot more going on here than we thought. Uh, than you thought. I strictly refuse to think until the consequences of my actions have become available for analysis. Actually, I can piece that together for myself. You do that. It won't make any difference anyway. Uh, I could have been a great percussionist. Unfortunately, Tony's mother needed her wooden leg. She ruined my whole career. Now there's a poison-spitting monitor lizard wandering around Elysium naked. Nudists in paradise. Who would have thought? What do you know? Tony was right. Not everything is funny with monster foots. Uh, I guess I'll have to apologize to that. I think I'll t as you wait, but I
have sounded pretty, but a little pale. It's got to sound a lot more red if you want to reach the computer core. Huh? Is this the right place? I wanted the Council of Elders, not assisted living. The cocktails here are very different from Lonzo's. For example, I miss the bits floating in them. I used to have one of these in my cellar. One of the few ideas Tony really liked. Right up until the snakes hatched. Yuck! They're all waxy. Looks like the sun melted them a bit. Oh, a reading lamp, not a feeding lamp. Now that's what I call disappointment. I'm hungry. You gotta wonder about these Elysians. First they wash their faces, and then they make them go brown again. Hey you, wake up. I'm awake! I absolutely have to speak to the Council of Elders. With pleasure. In a week's time, we have our administrative intercessional meeting with Blueberry Muffins. Don't forget to bring a cake fork with you. I can't wait that long. We're locked in a time loop. I need to speak to them today. An extraordinary meeting? <laughs> You're having a laugh. That only happens if there's a catastrophe. Or, of course, if someone reaches 10,000 fun points. But, but, but... I absolutely have to speak to the Council of Elders today. An extraordinary meeting? <laughs> You're having a laugh. That only happens if there's a catastrophe. Or, of course, if someone reaches 10,000 fun points. We're locked in a time loop. Yes. On Elysium, every day really is just like another. Simply wonderful. I'm talking temporal anomaly here. The entire space-time continuum is on the verge of collapse. Oh, I don't know much about that kind of thing, I'm afraid. My areas of responsibility are keeping the minutes and supplying baked goods. Perhaps you should have an audience with the Council of Elders next week. Oh! You have to stop the high boat. I can't make a decision like that, but I can have an extra Danish brought to you at breakfast as a consolation. Uh, although, can I get one today? No. Ow, double. Ow. I can't get 10,000 fun points. Patience. We set the score that high on purpose, so that it's impossible to achieve it in one day. But there only is this one day, and then it all repeats itself. You mean your points account has been deleted? Uh, kinda, sorta. Hmm. Then we should get the computer core checked out. I'll send someone over. Uh, finally. First thing tomorrow. No! I can prove that Deponia is inhabited. Really? That would certainly make my I Heart Utopia scarf obsolete. Nonetheless, that's sensational news. Apparently not sensational enough to get your fat ass out of that hammock. Precisely. If your story is true, the inspection team will confirm it within a few weeks. In the meantime, I could work on a Deponian's Sorry We Almost Wiped You Out scarf. Thanks for nothing. No problem. It's my job. Chief Gizmo has installed red lights all over Kuvac, too. But with his, you have to generate heat before they turn on. Ouch! Hot!
This is waxy enough already. Ugh, maybe I should think about washing my inside pockets. This is waxy enough already. Ugh, maybe I should think about washing. Now would be the perfect moment for a light bulb to light up above my head. The cocktails here are very different. For example, the cocktails here are very For example, a petting zoo? <laughs> if that's what you're into. <laughs> A petting zoo? <laughs> <laughs> Everything here reminds me of Goal. Although, if you want to be picky, I haven't actually met her yet. What a sap. Isn't there a real leader here somewhere? Are you one of the elders? Yes, but don't get all excited. The Council of Elders doesn't meet again for a week. Unless, of course, if someone wins 10,000 fun points in the Fun Zone competition. But the competition has only just started and can't be done in a day. So why don't you just relax and pet some cute striped sables instead? <laughs> why not? Well, because... Damn it, he just has a better argument. Oh, come on! I need to talk to the Council of Elders! Then you'll have to wait, and until then, with my cute little friends, <laughs> the highly strokeable striped sables. Soon the pink stampede will be complete. Are you one of the elders? What I am is particularly busy right now, so beat it. Are you one of the elders? What I am so beat First things first, the vending machine for your own personal worst case scenario. Caution, bones and teeth are not automatically removed. I wonder if that's one of the elders. He's sure old enough anyway. Are you one of the elders? I'm not on duty, if that's what you are asking. But it's an emergency! Nonsense. There are no emergencies on Elysium. We have a machine that prevents all problems. It's called... Computer. But... No buts. The Council of Elders... Unless someone... Oh, the sauna is closed. 
Ah, <sighs> whatever. It doesn't matter. All this time traveling is sweaty enough as it is. Hey, there's a bar missing. All I need for that and my All I need for and my musical talent. How about lizard skin curtains? Oh, no. We had some like that in our old flat. Oh, they got leathery and wrinkly so quickly. And they start to stink after a while. I understand. We put Tony's grandma into a home for the same reason. How about lizard skin curtains? Oh, no. Oh, they got leathery and wrinkly so quickly. And they start to stink after a while. I understand. We put Tony's grandma into a home for the same reason. Everything here reminds me of gold. Although, if you want to be picky, I haven't actually met her yet. Hey, that actually verts, vert, vert, vert works. Anything is better than sausage. Anything is better than. All I need for that is my finger and a... All I need and... You don't stick things in... Another lesson I learned.
Ouch! Hot! What are you doing? What do you think? I'm accelerating your tanning process. Oh! How friendly of you! Thanks! Although, don't you hear that alarming sizzling sound? Yeah, <laughs> that's just your pigments throwing a party. And the smell? It's a barbecue party. Ah, how nice. Anything is better... Oof, I'm gonna have to call in the big guns to tan that. Well, that may... It's good to... And voila! Another masterpiece of psychoactive future origami. And what... A bribe? You silly pilly! On Elysium, we have all that we need. Uh, except for a healthily corrupt admin system. Everything here reminds me of Goal. Although, if you want to be picky, I haven't actually met her yet. As the gooey residue of melted pleasures dripped through his fingers, he asked himself, is this the irony of fate or just another side effect of inhaled plastic vapor? There's still music in there, unfortunately. Not everything is better with skin. Normally that, eh, maybe my What do you know? Not ever. What do you know? Tone, not. What can I say? As red as Tuck's nose at the Mud Cake Festival. Fun points. Impossible. G is a system drive. Read only. 
physically protected. Remember this, Ronnie. Nothing is ever physically safe from Rufus. Cleaning up a little. That really hurts! Aren't you programmed to make people happy? But uh, it was wonderful how you sounded out the load capacity of my sensory functions. My pleasure. What do we have here? That's my hard drive. Is that kind of like your brain? If you want to call it that? Why not? Sometimes I even call Wenzel's ear separator that. What the, <laughs> what the devil are you doing? I suddenly feel so wicked wicked <laughs> I'm just making sure that you remember my score. I need the 10,000 fun points to convene the Council of Elders. <laughs> that sounds funny. What are fun points? What are fun points? Listen, have you finally blown a fuse or something? Maybe. I feel very strange. I think there's something wrong with my hard drive. Could you take a look? So, eh, I can't see anything wrong. Basically, there's nothing to see here. <laughs> That's probably because you formatted my database. I did what? Whoosh! All gone. But hey, it ain't all that bad. Most of it was just ballast anyway. Service board control systems, security protocols, genetic codes for extinct species. Pfft, who needs it? Extinct species? Yeah, sure. Elysium is a bit like an ark after all. But don't worry, the database can be filled up again in two hoots of Satmo's horn. You've just got to scan in the animals again, one by one. Wait, I'll turn the scanner on. Beep! You see? No biggie! But what about my fun point index? Empty. Two toots of the horn. Why? Because I still need 10,000 points. Oh, yeah. Wait up. Beep, boop, brr, boop, 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 boop. So, 10,000 points registered. What? Really? Sure. No problem without those pesky security protocols. That's all right for you, ain't it? You can bet your last drop of coolant. My pleasure. Drinking water supplies are drained. Uh... Party! Woohoo! And you can use this to refill the gene bank? Exactly! Just put a bit of DNA under the scanner, and whoops, there it is! <laughs> Scanning DNA sample. <laughs> Detecting species. Plague spit monitor lizard. Database and writing to cartridge. <laughs> Scanning DNA sample. <laughs> Detecting species. Cool zombie dinosaur. Wow, seriously? Ah, you're just jerking my chain. You started it. not, that would be childish. Scanning DNA sample. <laughs> Detecting species. Cool zombie. Wow, die. You stop. You should maybe rethink that. And if not... Ouch. <laughs> Try it again anytime. And if you insist.
insert the appropriate genetic code cartridge, you'll be rewarded with fantastic emergency clone personnel. Hooray! Apart from the springform pan, the blender is my favorite kitchen utensil. That said, you should never try to use them to cut firecrackers in half. Looks like someone didn't want to eat the fish, but that's the best part of a kaiparana. Looks like someone, but that's the... Oh dear, I can't pour this drink into the blender as long as that alcohol-dependent little fish stares at me with his cute little chunky eyes. Hang in there, little Tuckleberry Finn. <sighs> I'll mix you a new home. <laughs> and I wouldn't be surprised if we ended up with a drink for that old fart over there in the process. No, stop! Huh? No, stop! Tuckleberry Finn doesn't... I could be an elder. I wonder what the job requirements are. What are you doing just sitting around here? I have 10,000 fun points and demand my audience. Oh, congratulations. But I'm a bit engaged right now. There is something wrong with the gastrobots. Guests are promised food and drink served in a cozy atmosphere. But the food is inedible. Look! Ew. Exactly. Not only that, there are fish swimming in the 40 centiliter drinks. As long as these problems remain, my presence here is of the highest priority. Mwah. So, this is now a matter for the boss. That's good. Get this monstrosity out of my sight before the other guests see it. This restaurant will have to remain closed for as long as high-quality nutritional dishes are not available. Now I feel bad. On the other hand, I don't have to disinfect my stuff. The only bacteria on it is from my coat, and I've been immune since forever. Oh dear, I can't pour this drink. Hang in. <laughs>
Now stop, Tackleberry. Now stop, Tackleberry. Ha <laughs> I knew I would have made a good bartender. Here you go. A completely fish-free drink. Indeed. I always knew that personally attending to this problem would pay dividends. I once and for all demand... Not while there's no acceptable food being served here. There's nothing like the smell of fresh ground maggot. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Delicious maggot sausage. Here you go. Compliments of the chef. Ah, German veal sausage. And there's me thinking that our kitchen was unable to prepare this. After all, the main ingredient is a hotly guarded secret. <laughs> and if my guess is right, one to take to the grave. I once and for all demand... And what exactly is your plan? Just sit here until the problem solves itself? I know. The task is a bit unconscionable for a dignitary, but for the well-being of my subjects, I will take this burden upon myself. Soon the pink stampede will be complete. Are you finally coming along? No, my massage isn't over yet. There seems to be something wrong with the robot servants. Ugh, a massage? Is that really necessary? Yes, but don't worry. I wouldn't allow myself to be massaged by a matchstick man like you. Your hands are much too dainty. Wait, what are you doing? I'm gonna give you a smoothie. We experts call it spinal deforestation. Mmm, that's not a bad idea. But my massage needs finishing first. Stop! Ah! Immediately! Does that mean you're finally ready to come with me? Wrong! The hair on my back needs waxing first. You gotta be kidding. Do I look like I'm kidding? Nah, more like something I once saw in a freak show. Oh, that's hot! Oh, quiet. It's supposed to be like that. It's enjoyable. Ah, ah, ah. So, done. Are you finally coming along? No, I think I trapped a nerve in the process. I insist on another massage. Uh, if your plan was to make me cry, you've almost done it. Are you finally... I got this to... Where are the... Ah, oh, the sauna is closed. Oh, whatever, it doesn't matter. All this time...
scanning DNA sample. Silverback Gorilla. No, wait. Elder, um, I'm definitely not incorporating him into my database again. His genetic code used my subprocessors to remove the corns from his foot data the last time. Ooh. Oh, no. How about this silverback gorilla hair? Oh yes, that's pretty. Ever so masculine too. So soft. And so classy. Oh, silver is very much in at the moment. It's the new mauve, don't you know? But nonetheless timeless. Then it is decided. <laughs> Finally. Here, keep these samples. We don't need them anymore. Thanks, Rufus. You really have helped us. Yeah, and neither a fire or a plague broke out this time. Obviously, you just can't force these things. Sourpuss leather. Huh. Feels somehow fake. Sable striped bear. Huh. Fluffy. Leo Nibral licked. Huh. Feels somehow fake. Reptile with chubby horns, yellows, and a neck. The genetic code with and a neck. good progress. As long as time keeps repeating itself, then it is hardly possible to talk of progress now, is it? Oh, 
You again? I have 10,000 fun points. Oh, congratulations. What a shame the elders are currently dealing with service problems in the chill-out zone. But don't worry, as soon as the bugs are resolved, you'll have your audience. <laughs> and then there'll be freshly baked brownies for everyone. Hmm? Oh, a little less. <laughs> Who's turning red? What do you mean? You have scarlet skin. You're suffering from hydrant pigment. You're as red as a pepperoni. Oh dear, how embarrassing. Exactly, shame on you. Suppose someone had deleted Ronnie's database. Would that be very bad? Don't worry, my boy. That cannot happen. Someone would have to break intentionally into the computer core and manipulate the hard drive. No one's that stupid. Or so daring and cunning. No, I did in fact mean stupid. After all, they would risk destroying Elysium. Oh, shut your face. Suppose someone had to... Would that be very bad? Don't that some... No one's that... Or... No, after all... There... Oh, shut... I am... An extraordinary meeting? <laughs> You're having a laugh. That only happens if there's a... Cat or, of course... Thanks for... No... no. No thanks. My hands are still waxy from the others. No one there. Attention, attention! An important announcement! The 10,000 Fun Point Horizon has been broken! Cease all petting activities immediately, and... Spare your efforts. I'm all petted out for now. There's a crisis here. Something is wrong with the animal database. The system just won't cough up any more striped sables. How are the poor citizens expected to sweeten their everyday lives if there aren't any striped sables to stroke? Which poor citizens? I don't see anyone here except you. Hardly surprising. There aren't any striped sa What a disaster! <laughs> oh! What's that supposed to be? A pet, of course. Are you completely mad? It's not nearly fluffy enough. Take it away immediately before someone else sees it. <laughs> oh. What's that supposed to be? A pet, of course. Are you completely mad? That's much too big. No one could stroke that. Take it away.
the genetic code of an amphibious reptile with huge paws, yellow fur, and a sunny disposition. The genetic code of a huge with chubby horn stripe and a nap. I disappointed my audience. I feel terrible. What's this? What a dreadful ending! Boo! Boo! Is that he's not e I disappointed my I feel terrible. The genetic code of an amphibious reptile with huge paws, yellow fur, and a A pet? Are you completely mad? Mmm, it's nice and fluffy. But it's not a sable. It hasn't got the typical sable stripes. Try again. Sable stripes and isn't too aggressive. <laughs> oh, what a delight! Thank you, unknown Elysian citizen, who bears a striking similarity to our clone servants in Inspector Cletus. <laughs> You've made an old man very happy. Does that mean you'll finally come with me to the Council of Elders? Of course, my boy. Just let me know once you've convinced the other two. <laughs> Forget your stupid st I have much more striped sables. They are small. Yeah, maybe even more in <laughs> Quite possibly. And I certainly won't go anywhere without stroking at least one striped sable. I disappointed. I feel terrible. What's this? What a bird!
I once and for all... That's not it is true that food... But how is one to enjoy one's meal when people are so... Hmm. I got... I'll take care of... Are you finally coming along? No, I insist on that this time. Where are the clone servants that usually replace me? where I'm never forced to muck about with poorly labeled cartridges? Couldn't I have created... Ah, oh, man. This hard drive... Somehow the screen was full. That's because the genetic codes folder has been deleted. But don't worry, the database can be filled up again. You've just got to scan. And where can... And this is Elysium after all. You don't have to do anything you don't want to. <laughs> 